what's your view on uh, on this and the decision to hike fees? Right. Um, I think that we can do both. We can attract talents and students because we need that for the entire economic ecosystem when we think about uh, artificial intelligence, when we think about Nordvold that is coming and we're so excited about it. And at the same time, we can protect our beautiful French language. So I, I definitely invite uh, the government to not lose sight on one of them, one of those objectives, but it's something that is doable. And, and for me today, I guess I'm, I'm, I'm disappointed because it, it kind of brings a, it's, a, it's hard for the uh, international reputation of the uh, metropolis of the province of Quebec. It hurts. It gives a, a, a difficult signal, a message. And also, we would have liked to be uh, better uh, informed to know in advance. It would have been great. Are you inviting the government to roll back this plan, cancel it? Well, I, I, want, I want the government to maybe have a, bring some answers and a bigger perspective and not to limit this, this issue to uh, liking or not liking the, the French language. To me, it's way bigger than that. If this, gov this gov government strongly believe in a strong economy, they want to reduce the gap between Ontario and Quebec, I have to say, this measure, what it will support is more people going to Toronto universities. Let's be honest. So for me, because we all want to have a strong economy with a lot of talents. We can protect French, but we should also be, uh, you know, we should uh, invite and make sure that the reputation of the metropolis of Quebec is not being hardly affected by that, this decision.